So Gen G vs BLG finished up a little while ago, and as the likely preview to the MSI Finals this year, it was kind of an underwhelming series. I gotta say, outside of Game 4, none of the games were very close. Game 1, BLG got ahead early and stomped the game. Same thing with Games 2 and 3 in favor of Gen G. Game 4 was really the only competitive one, and it was very competitive as an absolute banger game. But it, the series overall was kind of disappointing. I did predict Gen G to win, but I thought it would be much closer. I thought BLG would be able to contest them a little bit more than they did. So, coming into it, I thought Gen G was the better team. I thought they had the better better team play, better map movement, better overall macro, and they matched BLG's mechanics and micro play well. But it turns out that BLG just I don't know. It seems like they kind of just fell flat, or maybe Gen G really is just that good. Honestly, I don't really know why the series wasn't that competitive. It was, um, you know, the same old drafts for the most part, outside of some Nidalee picks and a cool Diana pick, which didn't really work out. But um, other than than that, there there wasn't really anything special about this series. It was just kind of anticlimactic in my opinion, pretty underwhelming in terms of a, an, a finals preview. And honestly, if G2 keeps playing the way they've been playing, I think that they can beat both T1 and BLG and probably make it to finals. That's just my opinion. Um, you know, maybe BLG had an off day today, but um, it definitely wasn't the series that I was expecting. Um, you know, with the best top player in the world and with mid and ADC being top two or three in their respective positions in the world, uh, I definitely expected a, a little bit more from BLG. Um, with that said, Gen.G is obviously an insane team. Um, I th obviously predicted them to win. I just thought it would be a more competitive series than it was. So honestly, I don't really have a lot of analysis or <laughs> much else to say about this series. It was just kind of disappointing, anticlimactic in my opinion. Um, and the, the, the BLG just kind of fell flat. So hopefully if these teams meet again, that it can be a closer, closer matchup. Um, this does mean that B BLG falls to the lower bracket, and they will face the winner of T1 G2 tomorrow. That is a very exciting matchup, the rematch between these two teams that had the very, very close best of five last time. But I gotta say, if G2 keeps playing the way they've been playing, and T1 plays the way they did against Team Liquid, G2 will win this series 3-0, 3-1, and I don't think it will be very close. Will that happen? Probably not. I think T1 will show up. I think... These, like I said previously, these two teams always play each other very competitively, and uh, it's going to be another banger matchup. But I would not be surprised at all if G2 wins. In fact, I'm actually predicting G2 to win three games to one. So that means that if that happens, they'll be facing BLG, which I think, again, given the way G2's been playing and given the way G2, uh, BLG played today, I think it's a completely winnable matchup for G2. Um... You know, I've been very impressed with G2 so far this tournament. I think everyone has. They've overperformed and greatly exceeded expectations in everyone's eyes. They're the only Western team that has really shown up at all. So that's been really nice to see. Um, but again, in terms of this series today, not really a whole lot to say. Um, you know, Game 4 was a really entertaining one. But other than that, all three games uh, were just kind of stomps. And whoever got ahead in the early game just kind of snowballed and won from there. So it wasn't that, you know, coming in, I had very high expectations that it would be a very close and exciting series. It did not end up being that. Um, but like I said, hopefully if these two teams meet again, uh, they can be a little more competitive with each other. Anyways, let me know down in the comments section what you guys thought of the series today between Gen G and BLG and uh, predictions for tomorrow's series between G2 and T1. Super excited for that matchup. Thanks for watching. See you next time.